All right, let's watch this here. Can't make a good soup, can't do a handstand in a pool, can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. I think it's neat. Uh, I like I like the idea, obviously, that you have a fish instead of a human. Like your backdrop, there's a lot of good stuff that you can do with this. Um, I understand your questions, and I think they're both valid. They're both, there's good stuff with having a hook in and how that would affect animation and everything. My main problem with this is that if you listen to this... Can't make a good soup? Can't... Like that hook is, is not affecting her speech at all. And as of now, she does everything she would without a hook as well. Um, my thing is probably keep the trash. I would say keep the trash and get rid of the hook. Only, I mean, I like the idea of the hook, and I think you can incorporate that maybe at a later point. But right now, it's one of those, like in those 11 second club things where everything is in it, but it doesn't really make sense. Like, I don't hear how the voice is affected by the hook. Like, that would be funny. If you had something in the voice, and you have that as a reason for it, I think that would be funny. It's not, gonna, not funny for the fish, but as an idea, it would be cool. So I would probably take it out. Also, you know, there would be something if, if she goes over here, the hook would pull, and then she gets pulled over there. Stuff like that. But again, this would affect her pattern, her speech pattern, how she talks and everything. I don't think any of that is reflected in the audio. So... Now, since she is saying... Can't make a good soup, can't do a handstand in a pool, can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. That's a good, that's a good line. I think having the trash in there adds to the whole depressive nature. I think that's okay. I think what I would do actually is... Uh, it's cool to see all that stuff here. Oh, there's an arrow. I'm drawing arrows. I'm actually wanting to draw free hands. There you go. Um, I would probably put the fish around here and bring that camera lower so we are actually looking at something like that. You might potentially have it pointing up a bit if you want to see some cool stuff in the back here. But um, Because... Can't make a good soup. Can't do a handstand in a pool. Can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a like after lieutenant? I don't know, some reason I envision her floating out lieutenant and then like lieutenant uh, and drops. There's a lot of cants in my life right now. Like drops and then uh, right now. And this could be a moment where she could almost settle into into the the sandy floor. Not that fish do that. Some some of them do, but you know, you got some freedom here. Um you know, like, she's depressed, she can't do stuff. I think having her kind of uh, go down could accentuate that and could fit the whole mood of it. Or, let's watch this again. Can't make a good soup, can't do a handstand in a pool, can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. Yeah, not that the sound would do that. I was thinking during the pause here. Can't spell the word lieutenant. Lieutenant. And at this point, because she has that in there, it gets kind of tangled up and held back by something that's on the ground, you know, like something that you have around here. And then, ah, uh, kind of like, ah, uh, just gives you that kind of look of, man, this is all such a pain in the... There's a lot of cants in my life right now. And then you hear that. I hear like, footsteps in the background. Can't make a good soup, can't do a handstand in a pool, can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of cants in my life right now. <laughs> at the end, someone's walking at the end. Uh, I was just wondering, maybe you would then extend the pause by like a second, but since there's so much noise here... Tenant, there's a lot of cants in my life. That would be odd. Like you, would, you could probably hear the whole copy-paste of the silence, but... But that could be something where she does all this here and at the end, Lieutenant, and then gets held back, pulled back and frees herself, and then... Oh, and that tells her... I can't in my life right now. You know, there's a lot of stuff. She can't even swim properly because of that. I don't know. That could be something. Um, the way you have it, let's pretend we would keep all this, right? I would not do anything after here because we don't see her face. It's a weird thing to have her be away from us. Um, and it's very, not very profile, but that's just, it's a weird angle. I like that idea, but I wouldn't do it twice. This feels more like, yay, yay. But I like... Spell the word lieutenant. 
spell the word, that's fine. But then go into a regular, like, no lower than this, into a, a kind of a, you know, you can have a way and then kind of swim around type of thing. Um, but just, I wouldn't go away from this. I don't know. So again, setting-wise, I'll probably take the hook out because it feels so disconnected. And if you have this, it would be neat to incorporate the trash into the scene where she gets affected by it more. Again, I'm not sure if that will fit into this pause. Maybe, maybe it doesn't have to pull her back a lot. Maybe she just gets tangled and realizes she can't really swim forward enough. And then at the end, there would be there's a, lot of, a lot of cans. You know, maybe something is not that this is your framing, but something is hooked up here, and she's kind of like, uh, uh, she realizes, oh, this is all not really working for me, uh, and it's kind of hanging off this thing. Maybe. Um, so I have a lot of non-answers. <laughs> can't make a good soup. Can't do a handstand in a pool. Can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. The thing is about the ending. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. It doesn't sound like a very defeated thing. That's why also the idea of getting all tangled up and all sad. I think it's not. I'm not super sold on my own ideas. Only because it's a very... Uh, not a forceful, but it's a very distinct and angry delivery. It's like she is, she's telling that to someone. So I think that anger would have to be reflected, even at the very end. It couldn't be like some deflating something. I mean, you could have that and take some of the ideas of of your guy, where you know she's constantly moving, right? So what if? This might be too much, but I'm just throwing an idea. What if it's, you know, closer to the ground, you got stuff here, the way you have it here. Uh, and there could be another fish here. I know, you're going, what the fuck is he talking about? But imagine this is the thing here. And all the fish is doing is looking and following the guy, having a little head turn. Not not, not even head turn, just kind of looking. And it'll, you know, imagine it looks, looks to the right and the head goes a bit to the right and kind of floats, floats, well, a little bit. Um, just tiny little things while she's going rah, 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 rah. So she's kind of doing this around the guy while he's just kind of listening I think that could be something interesting so that way she and again not that you need two characters you can argue that she can just tell that to herself or the other characters off screen but that could be something interesting well where I feel like at the end when she is still so forceful it's because she's telling someone she's so angry she's not convincing, but she's telling that to someone. And I could have a, a, a interesting little dynamic where you know you got your ground with your your stones and stuff here, and that guy's just kind of oh, what's going on. He's just rah, 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 rah. while this guy's saying, I don't know. That's an idea, maybe. Yeah, I mean the the cans would be something where she would be in an aquarium. You know, she says there's a lot of stuff I can't do right now. Well. One of the things is she's in prison, she's in an aquarium. Uh, as a setting, that could work. Or this is totally different and potentially makes no sense whatsoever, but it's a cartoon, why not? Imagine um, she's still talking, some she's talking to someone else, but imagine this is a wall uh, of an aquarium, right? Whatever, can't draw. And then this is another, this is hers. Guy's here, uh, listening. Right, it's my fish, by the way. It's awesome. It looks like a dead guy. Blue, blue, blue. It's dead, and she's here. Well, maybe the gap is smaller, uh, and she's doing all that stuff here. And every now and then, um, you know, when she change colors, you can see this. So imagine she she tells him right, and he will kind of like nod and like yeah, I understand. She goes away, angry, comes back, goes away, comes back. So frustrated elements where she goes away because she's frustrated comes back because she wants to tell them she is telling the guy and the idea of the guy listening just like before in the middle he's just there and just following her and has you know moments of kind of floating down coming back up a bit floating down you know potentially whenever she goes uh, and gets angry comes back to the glass he might have a little flap 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 like a tiny bit of a with those lower fins coming back up a bit drifting down going back up a bit drifting down um, that could be something potentially so you know she's commiserating to a fellow guy maybe that's 
they're somewhere in a on a, in a market imagine like Chinatown and you're just telling that to someone else who's trapped ready to get sold or eaten and then you can imagine that like, a top view would be there you go change color so that's that's one of the guys and she's in here and the camera is around here um, filming this whole shit, right Again, it's probably not needed at all, but I'm always thinking about stuff that is not needed. Imagine there are, you got walk cycles of people walking this way and this way. And that's like behind, all the way behind them as kind of ambient noise, movement, animation stuff. Uh, you can't even draw a straight down line. So you got your, imagine this would be your your aquarium, maybe like there's like a table here and he's on a different one. Uh, and I got my super delayed awesome tool again. So, and then you got some sand here, blah, 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 the bubble stuff and some grass and she's saying all that stuff here. And this guy's listening to here, but you can kind of see all the way back and then you can have legs. And I'm thinking what even if there's some legs in the foreground that walk by. And I'm only thinking about this when she says there are a lot of don'ts. What is she saying? Let me erase. I gotta erase this before I play this. Can't make a good soup. Can't do a handstand in a pool. Can't spell the word lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. Not that you have to incorporate the sounds. I wasn't thinking about the sounds and having someone walk. But I'm thinking when she goes, lieutenant. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. Um. Okay. It's gonna be very complicated, but. This is probably way too much. I'd still be curious to see it. And so imagine, again, you're probably going, man, this is way too long. Why did I email him? Uh, two aquariums. Camera's here, right? And as they say, as they walk, again, there's no real audio to, to support the market. I'm just throwing out ideas here. Where, you know, you see stuff in the background, you see just legs going back and forth. It's a busy, busy area. You might argue maybe it's just a dentist office, which might be too much like Finding Nemo. But I hear the sound, you know, of high heels on the floor, whatever. Um, but imagining, right, she delivers the whole line. And we see about this much of the scene, but we see all the way back. Uh, guys listening, and she's talking, talking, talking. Until she has that moment towards the end, where is that pause. And imagine she goes back and forth telling the guy right tells him goes back tells him goes back and on the go back you have legs in the foreground walking and that's what catches her eye right and she follows that and kind of does a turn and that's why there's the pause and then she goes well there are a lot of cans right now in my life that's the line I'm already feeble in my brain I can't remember but that's what she says right so the leg goes this way it kind of visually brings her around and she follows her she follows those legs with her eyes and then says that line and at the very end right now at the very end right now she would have a head dart an eye dart looking back at the guy right if that makes sense i wish i could activate my camera right now and i should have done it at the very beginning so i could act out with my face but that's the idea right where she would she would say this Hold on, let me stop this and copy paste my awesome acting. Hold on. All right, I'm back and this time with a camera. <sighs> so I'm saying at the very end, right? So I'm going to go back to... So imagine she says all this. And again, I'm going to draw on a tool. Imagine there's... Pen is not aligned. Worst critique ever. But you're not surprised by that, right? So you got the glass here, glass here, right? And she says all that stuff here. Guys listening. That's my guy. I don't know what I, I was drawing scribbles, right? And you see stuff going in the background. And you got, you know, the grass and blah, 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 blah. And you can have those moves where she goes away, talks. I have sound when I play this? Yeah. There's a lot of cans in my life. Can't make a good soup. Can't do a hand. So she goes forward. Can't make a good soup. Like, then I can't a good soup. And remember that uh, reel. The thing with prison food that might worry me is that someone might try to poison a prisoner and I might accidentally get the plate that was meant for the intended victim. 
That would be bad. Let me know if you don't know at what reel I'm talking about with the Nemo and you got you got um, Ellen DeGeneres, right? You got that head thingy that's totally your acting there. So she goes. Can't make a good soup. Can't. So can't make a good soup. Can't make a good soup. Hole like can't make a good soup, and then turn around. Can't do a handstand in a pool. Can't. Can't do a handstand in the pool. But she would do that like floppy like can't do a handstand in the pool like that 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 like that would be kind of a beat you could hit. Can't spell the word lieutenant. So then she could she he would, okay let's go back right. She goes back here. Da 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 da. Then can't do a in the pool. And she would go up. And then kind of float down. Lieutenant. Can't spell lieutenant. Spell the word lieutenant. Let me erase this. Again, here, here. It's the most confusing thing ever, right? Can't make a good soup. Can't. So she goes, can't make a good soup. To the guy, turns around. Can't do a handstand in a pool. Can't. Can't do a handstand in the pool. Like da 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 da. Up, goes up, holds this. Can't spell the word lieutenant. Can't. And then, you know, can't with the head of it. She goes down, can't, floats again down, can't, spell lieutenant, right? Spell the word lieutenant. Can't spell the word lieutenant. And on lieutenant, that's when you have those ginormous legs, boom, boom, going in front of her screen, from between the camera and her. There's a lot of can'ts in my life. Right? So she would say, this is the part where I'm acting down. Spell right? the word lieutenant. Lieutenant. There's a lot of cans in okay, so Lieutenant. Like, Lieutenant. Like, she goes this way, right? And then the legs grow this way. Lieutenant. And then sees the legs. And has that moment of... No, 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 Right? So she follows that, and at the very end... There's a lot of cans in my life right now. Let's see. Can't stand in a pool. Can't <laughs> spell the word Lieutenant. There's a lot of cans in my life right now. Something like that, where she goes like that. Has the... Has those legs. You know what I mean? That type of thing where... The word lieutenant? Can't. There's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. Something like that, where she, she can't spell the word lieutenant, follows the legs, and as the legs go off screen, we just see her staring like, oh, there's a lot of can'ts in my life right now. Like, man, there's really nothing I can do, but at the end, I can do my life right now. And I'm like, you know, like, with the fish, it would be like, goes around, I'm in my life right now. And does, and addresses the guy at the very end again, just like the very beginning, it's full circle. Um, and he would be like, eh, whatever, like, yeah, you're kind of a weird fish, whatever. But it would be like, eh. so that way you have that foreground element for contrast, and it, it motivates her acting, it gets her out of that funk, right? She complains, complains, complains. Why is she suddenly snapping out? Again, you could have it without legs in the foreground, but it could be something where she was, eh. You imagine, like, you're doing something and you're going, and you're being snapped out of that, and you realize, oh, man, yeah, I've been complaining. Man, this is why I've been complaining. And then that's your your ending. That's kind of what I would do. Um, long story short, I hope it helps. You're probably going, what? The um, but that's what I have. All right. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.